Welcome to Milford, Michigan and the Discraft Great Lakes Open presented by Grip6. You're watching the Disc Golf Pro Tour Playoffs presented by Barbasol. Stand still for Oliva. Stands and delivers a bullseye hit, Oliva. Immediately out of her hand. Owen loves it. Great shape and just a couple of feet above that flat platform up on top. Now Missy Gannon up ahead on hole number four. She's in circle two. And she really needs this to connect with the chains. There is a downhill slope. Oh, yeah. Oh, playing to the right side of the pin to have it track. Next to the basket after the skip, Owen will remain one under through three. Jennifer Allen on the tee of five. This needs a late hookup. If it can stay clear, she's going to get it. And Jen Allen passed the basket on the 480-foot downhill hole number five. Framed up nicely as she's attacking the basket on four. Scoggins now left with the lone birdie opportunity on four. And to extend her lead, she's done it. Own Scoggins, great start, two under through four. I love the height, I love the flatness, and Ella is up past the basket in circle one. Still a chance for bogey here. This is from... 45 feet. Oh, yes. Way to limit the damage. Hansen, a rare opportunity to pick up a stroke on Own Scoggin. She needs this. Yes. As we look at the leaderboard, of course, Own out in front by seven. Let's see who else is making moves today. Sarah Hokum. Currently up three positions. Haley King also up two positions. I love the caddy player short shirt coordination there. And even some, whether it was planned or not, the Discraft team coordination. Hansen can apply pressure by putting, putting it closer. Oh, look how wide she hung it out. Yes. Park job for Hansen. Tap in birdie coming up. Man, Cat Merch is really filleting her drives off of every tee box. All right, no questions here for Cat Merch. That's a tap in birdie. Jennifer Allen on the tee of nine. This is low and powerful, but it's getting a win lift. And we've seen the wind. Oh, and Jen Allen does convert. She moves to five under. I love the shape on this one. And it continued to flip and ride that line much longer than I was thinking. Here's Maria Oliva on the tee of 11. Love to see this drift to the right, and it's continuing to do just that. That's hunting for circle one. Maria Oliva, great drive. Scoggins found left side rough and converted on the putt today. A tap in. Alexis Mundahano, this is a long birdie bit on 11. And holds strong on the right hand turn. 
I like the looks of this. It just needs to hook up before grabbing any of those trees. That's going to track right to the pin. If you're not excited about what's going on in FPO Disc Golf, I'm not sure uh, what more you want. As Hanley is going to attack inside the circle. And this one gets all the way through, and it's inside a circle on the right-hand side. <laughs> on hole number 12, we're going to rejoin Missy Gannon. She's up ahead on the tee of 13. That's tracking toward the inside, but fights all the way through. Gannon will have a long look at Eagle. So this is a rare opportunity to pick up a stroke on own. We'll see if Cat Merch can do it. She's at circle's edge. Well done for Cat Merch. With that, Merch moved to 17 under. Hansen sits at 18 under, needs the birdie. She can pull within five of Scoggins. She got it. Her lead is five as we'll head over to 13. Hanley, T of 13. Hanley also will have a long look for Eagle. Excellent. Just inches outside of the circle, and Ella converts. And with that, the lead has dwindled to four. We see Gannon throwing her second on hole number 14. I'm still calling for an Eagle throw-in on camera. Gannon needs a skip to do so. And she'll have to settle for the drop-in birdie. First one that she's missed from short range today. So she is certainly keeping that demeanor on the outside, but confident and fun demeanor as she comes up, <laughs> finds herself just at bullseye's edge here on 14. This one's a little bit low. It's going to be right next to the pin. Oh, it's the koozie. Oh, wow. What was already a great forehand kicks up and rolls even further. That must have been like an 80-foot roll. Hanley with her second prime position here off the tee. Can she take advantage? It's low. Did she throw it hard enough to get the skip? She did. That is very close for the birdie opportunity. Can Hanson take advantage? Wide open shot. Best tee shot of the weekend on 15. And she's going to park it. Hansen, a chance to pick up another stroke on Own if Own doesn't convert from deep in circle two. You'd love for this either to be in the bottom of the basket or miss everything entirely. All to avoid a roll. Own for birdie. In the basket. Oh my gosh. Part of a champion and the putting goddess. Just when Hansen had a chance, Thanks, Owen closes the door on 15. Hanley for her fifth birdie in a row. Yeah. Nails it. Our lead card arrived. Maria Oliva had her second shot. Oh, putting it all the way up on the dance floor as well. And I was that just talking about this, Terry. Could we see some eagles? Yes. Maria Oliva, dark blue on the scorecard late in the round. Closing in now on her first Elite Series win on the Disc Golf Pro Tour. She's been atop the podium in plenty of FP40 rounds. In fact, she's undefeated. When she's played FP40 this year, she's won every event she's entered. Owen Scoggins now trying to pick up 
an FPO Elite Series victory. And that will all but <laughs> solidify it as Owen will have a tap in. Hanley also with a birdie look to make it six in a row. Even more impressive for the birdie, Holland Hanley. Own. <laughs> kidding, she needs to tap out. Well, you know, we've mentioned she is in the Masters division. They call it Masters golf when you usually let someone put out for you. <laughs> <laughs> that's not legal, so you're going to have to close the deal. <laughs> and now one more hole for Owen Scoggins. Scoggins with a four-stroke lead. Final tee shot. That'll be center fairway for Scoggins. One throw closer to hoisting the trophy. Ella inside the circle, trying to close out with a birdie. Now can she close it here? Doesn't need to. Well, she's going to put it next to the bucket that will secure the victory for Owen Scoggins. And even with a two-stroke swing likely here on the final hole, that will leave Owen with a two-stroke victory. But first, Ella Hansen, opportunity to close out with a birdie. Ella Hansen secures second place and your Discraft Great Lakes Open champion, Owen Scoggins. Your 2023 Discraft Great Lakes Open champion, Owen Scoggins. Owen, you tapped in your last putt and you jumped for joy and threw your hands up in the air after so long. You finally got it, your first Elite Series victory on the tour. How do you feel? Uh, I feel amazing. Um, I, om I almost cried when the, the cloud was here for me every day because it means a lot. I worked so hard. I never take a day off yet. I, I have been partying after the round. It just, it just finally, you know, my game come together. And I was hoping my days will be inbound and I have like seven to go again. But, um, but it is what it is. I'll take the win laying up and I'm super happy. Well, we look back at last season for you. You played so well, but you got second place five separate occasions. What changed this week that finally got you the win? Um, I think my drive, my part was come together. I didn't make much mistake. Of course, you're going to make mistake here and there, but I have a lad mistake in this weekend. And, you know, I think it's, it's have to be perfect game. And it's so hard to be a perfect game for like four days. And finally, I I take it and and... I don't know, it's just, it just your week is your week, so. Take a look at our final scores here at the Discraft Great Lakes Open, presented by Grip6. Owen Scoggins, your leader at 25 under, your winner at 25 under. Missy Gannon, battling it out throughout the day, making that charge. Her and Holland Hanley closing out strong. They're gonna finish all tied up in fourth. Jennifer Allen, also a solid day out there today at seven under. What's up everybody, Brian Earhart here, and thank you for watching highlights of the Disc Golf Network coverage. For more highlights and pro disc golf content, make sure to subscribe to us on YouTube, and to watch live professional disc golf, make sure to subscribe to us on the Disc Golf Network.